Since 1941, the Chesapeake Bay Detachments, or CBD's, mission, as originally conceived, was to provide facilities and services for test development and evaluation of radio, radar, and fire control equipment. Because of the elevation of the base, it was easy to construct facilities to test radar antennas at essentially mass head height. The detachment benefited from unobstructed, overwater ranges and by surrounding territory suitable for most types of airplane courses. Due to its unique location on the shores of the Chesapeake Bay, CBD performed radar measurements and various other experiments in conjunction with the Tillman Island site, just 16 kilometers across the bay. Starting with tests of the first production model radar late in 1941, many types of detection, ranging, and fire control devices were tested at CBD during the war years. The Chesapeake Bay Detachment has played a significant part in supporting the United States Navy and the Marine Corps. Over the years, CBD expanded work into other fields such as radar measurements, characterizing aircraft and ship radar targets, and studies related to all aspects of shipboard safety, particularly related to flight decks, submarines, and interior ship configurations. Examples of recent work at Chesapeake Bay include oyster restoration and revitalization efforts, and test and research in the effects of lithium battery fires. Its range radar facility, together with the Maritime Navigation Radar Test Range at Tillman Island, continue to provide the emitters and analysis tools for developing comprehensive maritime domain awareness capabilities. In conjunction with the ex-USS Shadwell, CBD and Shadwell remain the Navy's only full-scale damage control research, development, test and evaluation sites. <laughs> 